topic with me, Amy V. How are you guys doing today? So, I wanted to bring you another small little video today. Um, excuse if the lighting is is bad in here. It is very, very gloomy. It's been raining and gloomy all week, but I have been like, oh well, we are going to make some videos and make the best of it. So, if it's not as lighted, I apologize. Um, but that's why, <laughs> um, cause you know that I always use my, um, lighting from my natural big windows or natural lighting from the big windows here. So, but anyways, let's get on with the video. <laughs> so I wanted to bring you guys, um, a video on the new Milani, um, lip scrub and lip treat, uh, lip keep it smooth treatment. Um, I picked these up recently at the drugstore. And um, I wanted to talk about these because I am loving them. They are awesome. So um, basically, it comes in the boxes like this. Um, I believe I picked mine up from HEB, but I have seen them at CVS, um, Walmart. I believe Walmart. I know CVS and I know HEB for sure. I'm not for sure. I think I did see them at Walmart. I don't know. But those are usually the three places that I shop. But I definitely picked these up at HEB. Um, and it's called... Um, keep it sweet sugar lip scrub and keep it smooth luxe lip treatment now I know I've talked to you guys here before um, that um, I have very dry lips constantly um, I have a lot of texture on my lips I don't know if you can tell um, but I have a lot of lines and texture and my lips are always peeling too so I'm always having to um, just have a treatment for them and keep lip balm on them um, I was doing like my own little lip treatment where I would take, um, uh, was it honey and sugar? Um, and I would just like scrub them, um, and just do that, that, and then just put like a really good lip balm over them. Um, but I thought that this was cool because, um, I, the con it's already, you know, pretty much made for you. And I'm sure that it has a lot of good ingredients in it. Um, so basically the keep it, uh, keep it sweet sugar lip scrub claims that it will exfoliate and condition Leave lips soft and prepped for color. It's um, just apply a small amount with your finger. Gently massage lips to buff away dry flakes. Tissue off. Lips stay soft and smooth. It, you can exfoliate lips two to three times per week is what it says. Um, and then the the Keep It Smooth Lip Treatment. Um, Lux, Lux Lip Treatment. <laughs> There's a lot of L's. <laughs> um, it says leaves lips kissably soft. Ooh, I know my husband would like that. <laughs> And then provides instant comfort, which is so, so true. Um, basically, I have been putting it on it. So I'll do my um, lip scrub at night. And then I will put the lip balm on before I go to bed. Um, and I'm loving the way I'm waking up with my lips. They're not as dry, like, you know, in the mornings that like they usually are. Like, as soon as I, you know, get out of the shower, or wash my face and do all my skincare, I'm like, quick to put the lip balm on because they're just so dry um but this actually I wake up and they're not they don't feel like that as much and I don't know if it's you know of course it's probably the combination of the two but I absolutely love it so to jump in into the um product so basically um this is the lip scrub it comes in in a little bit bigger of a jar than the lip balm so basically the lip scrub is just it's like an emollient um and it has like these granules i don't know if you can tell um mine looks like that because initially when i opened it you have most of like the emollient on top um and not like the sugars or the whatever it is that's in there like the scrubs um, the granules so I took just a utensil and I stirred it up to mix those in there so that anytime I go in and do it I'm gonna get a good um, amount of the uh, granules to scrub away that skin so that's what I did with this one and then this one is just um, the lip balm it just looks like that clear it's beaut it looks beautiful on it I, it makes my lips look so plump and juicy <laughs> I love it because I don't really have I mean my lips are okay they're medium sized but I don't really have like a full big lip so which I think is beautiful I love it, especially when you have like lip color on it just looks so awesome but as you can tell I'm not wearing any lip um, stick or any lip uh, color today because I wanted to kind of do like a, just a little um, short little, you know, um, what do you call it? Tutorial. I don't know. <laughs> I 
just um, demo of using this. So, um, so basically, my hands are clean. I've washed them. Um, you could probably take a spatula or something if you have it, but I just use my finger. Um, I just make sure that I wash my hands um, before I go in, and you really don't need that much. Um, basically, I just take like that small amount like that. Um, and that's probably even still too much. I mean, you really don't need it. Once you mix it, those granules are all throughout. So I just take it and then on some on my dry lips, I just go in and you just scrub. And guys, I oh my gosh, this stuff smells and tastes so good. Not that I'm sitting here eating it, but you, know, you can't help but get the taste in your mouth. It literally smells and feels like you're rubbing cake batter with really big sugar granules <laughs> over your lips. Seriously, like it's so, it smells so good. I don't know if you've ever smelled, like if you've ever smelled their liquid lipsticks, um, if they have like that sweet cake batter, vanilla, sweet scent, like cupcake scent, that's exactly what it smells like, like totally. So I just take it. And just rub it in. I make sure I get the corners because that's where I really get dry. Sorry, I'm talking like this. <laughs> so yeah. And I'm just gonna rub it in. And go all around. And you just rub it in really good. And the granules are a good size. They're like a perfect, perfect size. So then I just take um, a little napkin that I have here. Um, <laughs> And it, and also when you're like when you're about this point right here where you've rubbed it in, you do get a little tingling. Like it's like I don't know if it's you know of course because you're rubbing that skin off that dead skin you're getting down to like your your fresh layer of skin that it gives you that little tingly sensation. It feels good. Um, I will admit the first time I did it, I don't know because my lips were so dry, like it it really was burning. Um, but now, uh, I think since I've gotten, you know, I've done it already a couple of times, it doesn't tingle as much, but I can still feel it. So basically you just take a damp, um, you know, paper towel or napkin or towel or whatever, washcloth, and you just take it off and it pretty much took off, <laughs> sorry, it took off some of my foundation. We'll fix that real quick. But yeah, basically I just do that. And then, um, what I'll do is, um. I'll go in with the uh, lip balm. I'm just gonna fix that. So it just fixes my little foundation around my lip <laughs> because it rubbed it off. It's kind of hard not to get it outside the lips. So I probably wouldn't recommend doing it if you already have your makeup done unless you really, really need to. But you can always like that. Just go in and fix it around my lip and then just kind of re-wipe off the lips like that. So basically then, I just go in with the lip balm. The lip, the lip balm smells exactly the same. It has that sweet scent, a sweet smell, like a cupcake smell. Oh, it smells so good. But guys, it feels so, I can't explain it. Like, it's not thick, it's not goopy. It's just, it almost feels like you're rubbing a moisturized water. I can't explain it like it's real thin and it's a balm I, I just it's got such an amazing feeling I cannot describe it but it's definitely not that uncomfortable goopy feeling it just moisturizes and just it feels so smooth and so nice on the lips like I cannot I am absolutely this is like hands down the best thing that I have found recently in the drugstore for lips um Milani did such an amazing job with this. Like, I absolutely love it. My high-end one that I love that I tried um, just in the Sephora store was the Sugar, the Fresh by Fresh Sugar Scrub or something like that. Like, that one is amazing. But it's also like, oh, I don't, I don't remember, maybe 20 something to $30 for just the jar like these, like the little, you know, uh, jar pots. But this one, I think I paid, I want to say... Uh, maybe seven dollars each for each one of these 
Um, and it'll last you a while, but I mean, I love these. I will absolutely keep these in my makeup bag, in my purse, on the go. Because like I said, I suffer from dry lips. If you're not one that suffers from that, you know, maybe you don't have the camera around, but just have it at home like for your night regimen so that you can moisturize your lips. But for me, I suffer from them all the time. My lips are constantly dry and I don't really wear, I stay away from liquid lipsticks because of that. But these guys, this is amazing. 10 stars will definitely be in my good finds video, hands down. Like, it's amazing. I definitely recommend these. It's so comfortable to wear. It doesn't get everywhere. It's just, I just cannot explain. I cannot say enough good things about these. So I definitely recommend these. I um, purchased these myself. They're amazing. And I will definitely repurchase. These are amazing 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 i cannot say enough good things about them now i want to do a little something real quick too um since i have been doing this treatment now for a couple of days i wanted to test out something that i don't normally wear which is liquid lipsticks now i do have a few in my collection just because i i have them and i you know i want it kind of jumped on that trend when it came out but it's not something that i gravitate towards because of my lines and just always dry and, and you know liquid lipsticks dry down so I want to give them, I want to give one a try just to kind of see how it, how it looks on the onset. They dry pretty fast and, and I have one in particular that I know dries pretty fast on me that I just want to try to see if it looks any different now that I have exfoliated and I've emoliated my lips, um, moisturized and all that. So I'm going to take a little bit of it off though, so that the liquid lipstick doesn't slip and slide. And we are going to try to put this on. I got a little sugar there. Um, so we can see how it looks. Now, on to I'm looking in the mirror right now, and my lips look so, um, I they look really good. They look just a lot smoother. I don't have as much of that dry skin that's around, and they feel good. I don't know to you. Like, they look, to me, look like they look a little bit more plumper, um, but that could just be me. <laughs> so let's try this. I'm going to put on the Milani um, color in Adorable, just a nude, but since I've got my eyes pretty um going strong today <laughs> i went a little heavy on my eyes guys i'm sorry <laughs> so i'm gonna try this one and see how this looks so i'm just gonna put it on like i normally would um and see if you know if it made a difference and i'm just going sorry i have to be like really careful And I don't even know if this color will look good. Probably not. It's really nude. But I'm just doing it for the, my, I just want to see like the wear test, like how it looks. And I know it looks crazy because I kind of took off like all that makeup around my mouth. But I just want to see. So on the onset, guys, honestly, of course, I can still see my texture. I can still see the lines if you can tell. But you'll see that even if I have like a lip gloss on, you'll be able to see that because it's just it's just genetic. I have it. It's just something that I deal with. But as it's drying, it it's doesn't look as harsh dried. Let's see, you see that line? <laughs> That's the Milani, it just does that, but I don't know. I mean, it still seeps into my fine lines, if that makes sense. Um, you can still see my texture, but I guess it doesn't feel as uncomfortable as it normally does, just a tad, it just feels a little better, but still, it's still dry. Um, but yeah, it definitely looks a little better. So I don't know, but anyways. <laughs> But I still love these. I think they're amazing. I think they're awesome. I think they are worth getting. Um, if you just, like I said, if you want to have like just a lip scrub to have on the everyday or to use two to three times a week. Um, if you suffer from dry lips or chapped lips constantly, I think this is amazing. Like I absolutely love it. I can see myself just wearing this on the daily, like the balm without even um, using lipstick. I could see myself... Uh, wearing this all the time and i'm just gonna put some else because make it a little moist yeah but i absolutely love it it's so so nice 
I mean, oh, I cannot express it. So yeah, so give those a check out, guys. I just wanted to bring that to you guys to let you know what my thoughts on them because I think it's, I definitely think it's a product worth having in your collection um, to carry on the go or to just use. So check them out again. It's the Milani um, Keep It Sweet Sugar Scrub um, Lip Scrub and the Milani Keep It Smooth Lip Lux Treatment. So all right, guys, I just wanted to bring that to you real quick. I hope you guys have an amazing day today. I pray that you guys are all doing well. And um, yeah, my hair is going crazy on this video today, but oh well, that's how we do. <laughs> I love my crazy, messy hair. <laughs> um, but yeah, so leave me comments below if there's anything that you guys would like for me to try um, next. Um, if there's anything that you guys would like for me to try to get my hands on and review for you guys. Um, also, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and push the little bell so you can know when I have a video out. And what else? Um, oh yeah, give it a thumbs up if you love reviews on different products, <laughs> um, lip products in particular. And also, um, check me out on Instagram. It is the same as here on the topic with Amy V. Um, I will always post there when I have new videos. Um, and have an amazing day. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs>